Here's what you missed on Fathead and Candy in the morning. Weekdays, 6 to 10 a.m. on My Country 96.1. My Country 96.1 Fathead. Once again, I have to uh, mention it is our 11th birthday officially Yes, today. happy birthday to us. Yeah, we'll be announcing a birthday show very soon. Do not miss it. We'll, uh, we'll be doing that uh, shortly. Uh, so uh, very excited about that. But yeah, 11 years ago today at 12.03 a.m., we... Uh, we flipped this station to country, and, uh, you know, in some uh, sense, it feels like 20 years, and in some ways, it feels like one year. It's really, it's bizarre when it I think is, of it. It is, it is, but we've had a good run together, you and I, and let's keep it going. Yes, we've been uh, we've been uh, doing uh, mornings and shows together since, uh, what, 003, 04, 02, 03, 04, somewhere Puffy. in there. Puffy, Puffy yeah. us together. He said, you two, I know, are going to work together really well. And yes. He encouraged us to work together and he was absolutely right. Yes, yes, no, he was a good he is a good man. Yes. Yes. He was, he was back then uh uh absolutely. He by the way, he runs the uh radio station at uh, Nassau Community College. He has Wonderful. been running Yeah, he's, he's been a good do, guy. doing he that for a long radio. time. Yeah. Here we are. <laughs> Here we are, Candy. <laughs> Here we are. How is your guest list coming along? Are they all safe and healthy for this Saturday, Candy? So far, so good. So far, so good. Uh, yeah, gearing up, it's a little hard because I have Christmas Saturday. I know people are saying, but Christmas was a month ago. No, not for me. It's this Saturday. <laughs> That's right. And you had to Insane. put it off. Mm -hmm. Had to, yeah. Mm -hmm. couple of couple so, of positive cases, yeah. Yeah, first my son, then my best friend and her daughter, then my other friend who was coming, her daughter. Now they're all uh, recovered and testing negative. And let's just say a prayer. Jackie, my daughter-in-law, tests often because she's a school teacher. So uh, she'll be testing. And I just, listen, on a wing and a prayer, let's get this holiday over. And the uh, the menu is in the freezer, right? It's been in the freezer for three oh, weeks I've now? Oh, I've taken out. I didn't make anything. I had the beef to make the meatballs. I took that out yesterday. I'm going to uh, BJ's for the uh, mushroom ravioli that I adore that I'm also serving. I'm making mm. penny a la vodka. And uh, Ellen, my best friend, is bringing chicken parmesan. Very nice. You're going to be all set. I love it. We will. Mm -hmm. I love it. Uh, maybe you'll use this. Today is World Quark Day. Have you ever heard of quark? No, I don't think I have. Q-U-A-R-K. I had not until now. Uh, quark is a European superfood staking its claim on supermarket shelves worldwide. I guess it's not huge here yet. Well, what it, is it? This is the description. Quark is a delicious, high-protein, low-fat alternative to soft cheese and yogurt that can be used for baking, cooking, and blending. Oh, interesting. There are no limits when using quark. If the menu calls for sweet or savory, hot or cold, quark cheese works well in place of almost any dairy. I wonder when it's coming here, because huh? I've never seen that. How many people on Long Island are looking up quark as we speak? Yes, Katie? yes. What a good thing. And let me tell you about my air fryer for just one minute. If yes, I can. yes. We had cod fillets, and we breaded them like you would for frying. Put them in the air fryer. Can I tell you, it was the best fried fish I ever had, and it wasn't even fried. Oh, my God. Delicious, I got to do this. crispy, so satisfying, so good, no oil. I got to do this. I have to do this. It was delicious. I'm telling you, the best fried fish, not fried, I've ever had. I feel like my life would be completely changed if we had an air fryer right on the well, counter. Well, it changed my son's life, and it's slowly changing mine. Today, I think I'm going to make cauliflower steaks in the air fryer oh my because God. a recipe came with it. That is a beautiful thing. It is, oh. but I have to just say, try it. You're going to love it. You should make, uh, for your Christmas party there this Saturday, you should make uh, uh, wings in there. Why don't you? Oh, first of all, the price of wings are soaring. <laughs> I don't know why, okay? But no, I'm not doing that. It's a big All right. thing. No. All right, and one more day for you. It's National Popcorn Day, Candy. The last time I ate popcorn, I got very sick. I don't think I should eat popcorn really? anymore. I did. I really love popcorn. Now, I know this style of popcorn is not good for you, but I'm sorry. There is nothing better than going to the movies and dousing your popcorn with movie butter, Candy. That's it. I love it, and I love that it's not all mixed through, so some of the kernels are saturated and others are not. <laughs> that I love. 
Ah, uh, movie theater popcorn butter. Oh, my God. It may not be healthy, but, boy, it's, not, it's good. I don't even think it's real. So, yeah, whatever chemicals they're giving us taste good, very good. And I do love cheddar popcorn. I do. Oh. Uh, I do. Uh, I'll, I I'll love, tend to uh, go that way. I love kettle corn. Yeah, yes. A sweet, too. Mm-hmm. Absolutely. Why not? Uh, Candy, some uh, good news for you. Um, an older guy in Ottawa, Canada, fell in the snow during a blizzard Monday. Uh, he could not get up. Luckily, an eight-year-old kid, I guess an eight-year-old kid was out playing or shoveling. I don't know. He found him, went and told his parents, and saved the guy's life, Candy. Wonderful. Love the universe and how it operates. Great. That's a and nice story. did you hear about the medical helicopter that crashed in Philadelphia last week? I did not. The pilot and all three people on board made it out alive including a two-month-old baby that was being transported, Oof. Candy. Wow. Uh, the pilot's name is Daniel Moore. He's in the hospital recovering. Uh, and then he did an interview the other day. Uh, he said the helicopter landed right next to a church, and he says, God must have been my co-pilot that day. I couldn't agree more. That is a bit of good news. I That's like to hear that. very good news. Good story. Yeah. Uh, So today, not bad. We're going to be windy and about 45, middle of the day, but sunshine. Tomorrow morning is what you got to look out for. A bunch of rain turning to possible snow in the morning tomorrow. So be on the lookout. Okay? Okay. Mm. And go watch This Is Us and let me know what you think. Definitely going to do that. Join Prime if you don't see this movie by the end of this coming weekend. We're through. All right. I am working on it. We will get that done. My country, 96.1. Fathead and Candy in the morning, weekdays, 6 to 10 a.m. On My Country, 96.1.